Um, oh, oh, come on! Oh my gosh, yes! yes. You know, that's what I say. Perfect timing, though. Instead of an... It's not. I'm not trying to make an entrance. Uh, okay, we'll start off and tell them who you are and like what have what have you done. So you guys have already. We haven't done it yet. We're no, this just way, me. Going that just way. me. You want to go right to left or? <laughs> we could rock paper scissors. I'm gonna. I know. <laughs> Somebody start <laughs> talking. Okay. Yeah, I knew that was coming. I'm uh, <laughs> Excuse me. I'm out of breath. Okay. Uh, Kerrigan Man, voice of Goldar. Uh, this panel's then and now, so that was then. <laughs> then part. Uh, I'll be the now part. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I, yeah. Oh my God, this one. Uh, so yeah, the the then part, Kerrigan Mayhem, the then part is 93, 4, 5, and 6. Right. And bottom line, it was, a, it was another world. It's that simple. Yeah. It was another world. Good luck with it. The now. World. Yeah, I'm the, I'm, the, I'm the now, I guess. Um, Hunter Dino, I was Pink Ranger for Dino Fury, and now I'm Red Ranger for Cosmic Woo! Fury. Wow. <laughs> so, <clears throat> so I am the first full-time female Red Ranger. Hallelujah. I like that. Yes. Woo! -hoo! Woo! I went. Oh, oh yes, you did. <laughs> um, I, am, I am Sicily. Um, I was... Young Aisha, the Yellow Ranger. Then, then, yeah. Woo! What are you up to now? Now, um, I am a chef and Ooh. a restaurateur, and I teach people how to cook oh, in their wow. homes. I'm gonna need a business card. I know, Sam. Yeah. 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 It's the sandwich ministry. Oh, yeah. So, oh, nice. Oh. Look at us together, a family. <laughs> do yes, isn't it the best? It really is. Look at our now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, let's talk. When you say sandwich, you what? don't mean that you just make sandwiches. I make um, very nutty sandwiches. Ooh. Um, at one point, I had a restaurant on Cal's campus in Berkeley, and we made really wild, like we had a sandwich that was called um, the chicken and the egg. And so we would take, um, we would make candied yams. Uh, for another dish, but then we would take the the liquid, like mm -hmm. the the sweet liquid, and we would make French toast mm. out of that, mm. and then we would make hot sauce. So we would do French toast, a fried egg, a piece of fried chicken. Oh my god! French that's, toast, that's awesome. a fried egg, powdered sugar, and hot sauce. Oh my god! That must be online because <laughs> I got you covered. Don't worry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love you. Thank mm -hmm. you. I do what I can. <laughs> that creation. Wow. Yeah. She's making those at her booth, so. Yes, yeah, send them by. They're under the table. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all can tell who's hungry up here. Yeah. <laughs> and Michael? Yes, Michael Gatto. I played young Tommy, uh, the White Ranger. And I found Tommy Zeo crystal in my last episode that made him red Zeo for Power Ranger Zeo. Nice. Uh, that was then. Hey. Now, um, I am in education. I was a high school teacher. I became a middle school principal. And now I'm uh, oh, wow. the head of a human resources department for a school district, so I hire teachers and principals. Wow, I didn't know that. Could I get a job? <laughs> Absolutely, just apply online. <laughs> Do they know how cool Hello, you are? <laughs> Do they know how cool you are? So my students, I was just telling this story. Yeah. Um, it wouldn't go too long before they would Google me and find out. <laughs> and then, you know, during my syllabus, <laughs> presentation. Yeah. It was an amazing syllabus, but they were like, I said, yes, you have a question about my syllabus? Were you a Power Ranger? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> no, no. I love it, that. It was wonderful. And, and I don't shy away, obviously. I'm proud to be part of this legacy, but it's not like I go up yeah. to people yeah, you and say, know. hi, my name is Michael Gatto. I used to you know who I am? <laughs> <laughs> anyway, that was, that is now. Oh, I guess I didn't do a I then. I didn't do the now part. Of I didn't do no. the then part. Yeah. Uh -oh. Look at that. You guys are well, the perfect pair. Well, Look then I was negative two, so. You're not going to do that. All right. All right. Let's go. We don't need to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't want to get me mad. I'm sorry. Why you? I just don't have a then now. That's a tough That's a tough act to follow. Sorry. No, no, no. So the then I did, and then now. Uh, I'm semi-retired. I got 
couple of screenplays that I'm trying to get somebody to read. I think they're good. <laughs> right. I, I've been told they're good. And, uh, <laughs> and uh, I play a lot of tennis. Um, I live for it. Singles. I'm not, I, I'm, not, I'm not a doubles player. I do. I will. I'll fill You don't it. trust nobody. No. No. And I don't like that ball behind me coming whizzing by my ear. That makes sense. I don't like it. Yeah. That makes okay. sense. So, um, that's it. Uh, yeah. That's that's my now, kind of. So, and I do I do these now that we're, now that we're back with these after COVID. Yeah. Um, We'll see how it goes. This has been a great one, you guys. This has been really a good yeah. one. Yeah. Uh, this has really been a good show oh, so yeah. far. Okay. So my, my now is I'm uh, still doing what I did then. I'm doing voiceovers for, well, Robo Rita showed up again. Yeah. Uh, I think I did a... <laughs> and Goldar didn't. <laughs> oh, we, we, we won't go. Did you do the voice for Goldar? I mean, he said it, right? I, it. <laughs> I don't know nothing about no Goldar Maximus. He was in Beast Wars. I know uh, what I said. No, okay. Am I bitter? I'm not bitter. No. I'm not yeah. bitter. And, um. Idiots. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know. Now I forgot what I was saying. So, uh, you know, I think I did uh, Mother Talzin for a, a, vi a video game again. And I, I even did Rita for a video game some oh, wow. recently. Cool. I don't even know what they're called anymore. But uh, World of War. Thank you. And also um, uh, doing a lot of World of Warcraft and, and Blizzard wow. video games. Oh, nice. Look at you! And uh, Netflix dubbing for the foreign uh, series. <gasps> what languages do you speak? Oh, I don't. I, oh. I do the English for oh, all oh, for the, the other ones. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. yes for the yes, people that don't want to <laughs> read. That makes sense. <laughs> so I'm doing all of that. So I'm, I'm like busy. I'm yeah. busy, and I haven't been to one of these since COVID, so yeah. you're my first. Yay. Woo. You know what, I, I'd be remiss if I didn't share that Saban also gave me the opportunity to play Drew the Blue Beetleborg on the pilot episode of the Big Bad Beetleborgs. So that was fun. Wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Now, did that pilot ever air, or have you ever seen it? It <laughs> never aired to my knowledge. Um, I saw some footage in ADR. But that was about it. Because okay. yeah. I know you no, did an interview. I saw an interview you did online with um, Cass that gentleman back in the here. back. Yes. He, uh, you did an interview about some of your time with Big Bad Beetleborg. Yes. It was fun. But if it's okay with y'all, I'm going to open up the floor to questions. Sure. Yeah. If anybody has, just stand up and tell who you, your point you got some time. <laughs> stand okay. up and ask your question. Yeah. Does anybody want to ask some of them any questions? <clears throat> yes, sir. Um, I was uh, wondering, is, what was it like to, uh, uh, um, like, with different studios? Because, you know, you've got, uh, it's, it was Saban, uh, you were... Uh, Hasbro. Hasbro, yeah. Uh -huh. is, is there, was there a difference in, like, the production? Um, well, from the time that they switched over to filming in New Zealand, no, there hasn't been a change in production from what I've heard and what I've talked to like previous rangers about. Now, I don't know when it was in the States. I have no idea how that was. <laughs> so I, I talked to people who it was Saban in New Zealand and it sounds exactly the same. Yeah, I don't know how it is in the States, yeah. sorry. Yeah. But I'm sure they were different. I'm sure because a lot of terms are different. <laughs> It's a great question. I think it's just hard to answer because I don't think any of us worked for Linear. two yeah. of the same yeah. Yeah. companies. Yeah. Well, I, I have to say when I did the movie, the first movie, and they were directing me at 21st, 20th 25. century. We were, mm -hmm. we were Fox. Yeah, the Fox. director Blood. knew less than we did about our characters. So we <laughs> just had to say, uh, mm, nah, I'm sorry, I'm... Yeah. I'm going to say it this way. <laughs> yeah, so our EP told us the same thing. He says, you guys know your characters more than anybody does. Yeah. Besides the writers, obviously. But so if there's a director, because I don't know, we had like five or six different directors for our, our first two seasons. So they just filter in for the block they're filming. So like if they want to suggest something that we don't feel like our character is going to do, our right. EP was like 100% let them know. And maybe we could do one the way they want and the way that you think your character will, right. and then there'll be a decision give them at the, the end. Choice, but yeah. 
they're wrong. Yeah, basically. exactly. Let's <laughs> make them feel right, but they're wrong. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, Barbara, you're both making a point. The, the director was very young. I mean, 25, 24, and there's oh, wow. nothing wrong with that. But as Barbara pointed out, he really didn't have a. He didn't. He. It almost looks like he hadn't done his homework. Respectful of who these characters yeah. were and were well established. And same deal. He 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 started giving me line readings right out of the gate. Yeah, you. This and is how you're supposed I'm, to. Say. <laughs> I, I just plain turned to him. I said, "Well, you know, I'm, I can duplicate your line reading if that's what you want, but it's not Goldar." And that was for the 95 movie. Yeah. 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 And, uh, yeah. ooh, that shot him up. He never said another word. No, don't tell us that. <laughs> 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 did you say that in the Goldar voice? <laughs> 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 that makes a difference. Like, if you were, That's I'm not, sure I don't know his voice. That. That's no, not the 95 movie Goldar costume is, to this day, terrifying. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah, and I never met, uh, uh, Free, what's Freeman's Free, the, 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 Ooze character. Ivan Ooze? Oh, I, you never met a, Paul. I, oh, I, I, no, Paul? I have not I, 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 I At know that him time, now. no, yeah. And he's the one of the nicest, dearest, and a revered actor. Oh, he's and, incredible. He's one, and one of England's highest, finest actor to date. Mm, and the most and, and a humanitarian. Yeah, really some, some cool cat. And I've hung out with him at these things, but I never met him until a Comic-Con. That's right. That's I right. single-tracked. Goldar, that means yeah. I'm alone behind a mic, and he did his recording. I don't even think he was. Oh yes, because he was in New Zealand, so he probably he probably shot his his, his uh, lines in in New Zealand as opposed to England. Anyway, I don't know what the point of it. Anyway, we're, we're going off <laughs> off yeah. topic. Thank you. <laughs> you were you were next. Yeah, yeah. yeah you a question. All right, so, um, Hunter, this was for you. Um, how did it feel to be part of a season, also the very first season, that also supported um, gay rights? I mean, it's amazing. I, my, well, my friend Michael Tabor, he played Riley, Green Ranger, and Dino Charge. I don't know if you guys like also, but there was like speculations, and he also kind of like said that he played his character, but they never addressed it in the show. Um, but it's great to be a part of a show that can address it and can actually put it on the forefront and give them a couple and a huge storyline. Uh, it's kind of great. Our, our season has a lot of firsts, and the fact that that's one of them is, is great. Yeah, exactly. yeah. And it's great also because um, what I was going to say is that um, it's also great for the younger viewers, like the newer younger viewers, to like get to be like educated on like you know like. People should be respected for like their their race, religion, sexuality, and even having a disability. Yeah, people are people. And bullying. They, I hope they're gonna yeah, address yeah. that. That's a big one. Oh, yeah, Kids that. Yeah. What, what is it? Especially like cyberbullying. Cyber There's so many things to address. Yes. I know. Then and I know. We have a lot then of other now. things that we do address and become the first on Cosmic Fury too. That. Uh, you know the answer. <laughs> I'm red. <laughs> Good answer. You know the answer. NDA. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I wish I could tell you all about it. Um, one mini question for Hunter and the rest of this is for all of you. Um, is Min Tran going to be any part of the Cosmic Fury? The special and Cosmic Fury are not cohesive. Mm -hmm. no. Correct. So basically they're not part of the same storyline. Correct. And the big question is, what are each of y'all's dream team-ups? Oh, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> or villain team Your character teaming up with any ranger. For me, I just, the OG Kimberly Hart. I would love, I would love yeah, for that. I would love that. Yeah. I feel like that's always my answer because I haven't met her in real life and I would like to. <laughs> Well, I just did it, and and uh, once and always accept this was not okay. For me. <laughs> <laughs> this man. Well, I'm hearing rumors that Goldar and Rito, being that we ne never did get reduced to sand because it was never seen, it's not, it doesn't exist. We disappeared. I'm hearing rumors that uh, Rito and Goldar will be coming back to your series. That could happen. I don't know about Rita. I what series? Because I'm not coming back to anything. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I'll be really hard to do. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that'll be trending on Twitter tonight. Yeah, yeah. right. Yeah, there we go. You're like nobody told He's me. He's starting a rumor. Uh, yeah, I mean, he I'm wants this. To... <laughs> well, Rita won't uh, come back. No, you know, no, we Rita won't be coming back. The table. I feel like honestly, the, the Alien Rangers never got enough time. That's fair. That's fair. They didn't get enough time. Alien Rangers didn't get enough time. <laughs> um, gosh, That's, I've been thinking this whole time. I, I mean, I guess I'd like to work with JDF too. Obviously, well, like yeah. that would have been a great team up. Absolutely, totally yeah. she's sure. a wish. JDF on, on, or Tommy on the, the yes. Cosmic, uh, oh god, that would the, the Dino really Fury Cosmic Fury cast <laughs> would be awesome. Who? Yeah. Tommy with your cast. <gasps> oh, I know. Yeah. It would have been such a great team up. Mm. That's okay. <laughs> Pitch it. Really? I don't know where you heard that from. <laughs> There's a bunch of things that have came out about our season that are untrue. <laughs> a bunch of things that are true, but a bunch of things that are not true. <laughs> so. All right, next question. <laughs> you were there yesterday, huh? <laughs> my, my real question is, um, I just love that last night, by the way. So Wasn't it so cute? Yeah. We do have a, a funny joke with Kai and Chance because Kai has the jawline uh, that can cut anything. <laughs> and Chance, um, his nickname was Queenstown because there's a place in the South Island of New Zealand called Queenstown where it's beautiful from any angle. <laughs> oh, that's wow. nice. So, <laughs> I, I think it was our hair and makeup department who started that, but it definitely became a thing. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. <laughs> pretty flattering. But I was actually wondering if you knew, like, arguably Amelia has a lot of, like, plot twists, and stuff, or if you maybe, like, didn't see coming, like, uh, Rapcon and becoming a Did you know about that? Yeah, so we don't know when we audition, we don't even know what character like what color we're auditioning for. I originally thought I was auditioning for Yellow Ranger. So I wore yellow in every single step of the process of the audition. Um little did I know, giggle. But um and then we got there to New Zealand and that's when they told us about our character. We knew like what color we were, but we didn't know anything about our character. And then so our EP wanted my character arc of being a Rafconian to be a secret until right before we filmed that block. So I had a meeting like six, seven months into the nine months of filming with him, and that's when he told me about everything. He was like, I want to schedule a time meeting so that you can ask whatever you want so I can help you dive deeper into that part of your character. And then so yeah, I knew that like six or seven months going in, and then we actually left New Zealand with being asked about Cosmic Fury. Um, it wasn't official, but they had like mentioned it to us and like, you know, contracts and stuff. But before we officially signed back on for a potential third slash fourth season, they told me that I would become red. And I didn't tell my cast because if I thought I should tell anyone, it's Russell. I thought if anything, he should owe since he's like passing the baton, you know? And I know that he doesn't like to find out things like that, like he'd rather read them. So I was like, if I can't tell him, I'm not gonna tell anybody. Yeah. So I didn't tell any of my cast until our EP did a phone call with us and told us all at the same time. So yeah. Great, smart. Yeah, I was like, I'm gonna be respectful to him. I know how he works and he's the only one who I should technically tell anyways. Yeah. So I'm gonna let everyone have it. And yeah. it's a little fun for me anyways. <laughs> Less rumor, just clean. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I told my, my parents and stuff, and uh, my dad has the loudest mouth ever. Like, <laughs> I, it's actually insane. Like, I would go to the bank with him, and he would tell the teller. Oh, my God. And I'm like, Dad, you, you can talk about the pink stuff, but you can't talk about the red yet. Oh. <laughs> like, you don't understand. He has, like, this, like, we go, like, him and his friends go to, like, this regular restaurant to, like, have dinner and drinks and stuff, and, like, a typical waitress that they like, and she knows everything. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> now, what restaurant is that? So, <laughs> 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 well, I'm, 
self-control. Yeah, well, I, I learned a little bit. My dad doesn't know everything now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dad. Yeah. <laughs> now, I got a question for Hunter, just because I'm a, I'm a fanboy. <laughs> when I first started watching uh, Dino Fury, I thought you and uh, Russell Zanko were going to have a <laughs> romance kind of thing. Everyone shipped me with everyone. <laughs> I, I still get shipped with Javi. Which is crazy because we've done two seasons and there's no relationship there. Um, but yeah, I had Russell for a hot second, everybody. And I fed into it a little bit. Like when I would meet people before the show came out, I'd be like, I guess you have to see. <laughs> <laughs> because then it was a bigger twist. That's true. Yeah. Causes so more. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But next question. Uh, yes, sir. Um, I got, uh, You're good. Go ahead. I'll get. I'll get right. uh, I've got a question for uh, you. Um, just because I really like his character, what was a uh, pop pop? Like? Oh my gosh, uh. Greg was amazing. <laughs> he, the first day we had on set with him, with him was um, unlucky strike with the whole ladder. So that was the first day on set with him was when like we had a stunt double up on a ladder with this like gray beard and everything, and we were like. Is that him? And he like walks up behind us. He's phenomenal. He's like exactly his character. He is, he's loud. Um, so loud. Um, he's goofy. He's fun. He was actually really, really great to have on set. He's exactly like Papa. I loved him. Kev, you had a question. Yes. Uh, so I actually want to ask uh, a not so common question. So a lot of times people tend to ask like, who is your favorite coworker to work with and you know, your favorite star, but do any of you guys happen to have anybody on the crew side that you may have maybe resonated with, you know, behind the scenes, whether that be a writer or a boom mic operator or a camera guy, director, anything at all? I would love to hear what, what it's like to connect with those individuals on a movie or film set. I love this question, yeah. but I feel like I've been talking, so someone else wants to go first. <laughs> Barbara, carry I don't, oh, you, you're talking about, though, the present. Oh my God! I mean, I, I got a list, but I nobody, know. I mean, uh, the late dear, my dear Scott. friend Scott mm -hmm. Page Pactor. Page Pactor, who has since uh, left us, uh, more fun to work with than anybody can tell or experience. Recording was so easy and so fun, and. It wasn't my experience. This was everybody's experience. Everybody who came through those doors, he made it right. And even the difficult people, he he got them on their on his side. He did. Uh, it was a, it was, was a so joyful, loved. joyful experience. He passed recording. last year. He passed last year. So sorry. And, uh, and he he also was. Um, he did this trick, this funny thing in the morning. He had us all do this recording where we said good morning we had to start the day with <laughs> good morning Becky and and we and, hey Becky and we, all of us did this little recording that we said all right that's a door ready to start now and he would also tape our bloopers and our little oh we'd all go to jail uh, today for and some of this stuff the naughty we things we would <laughs> add <laughs> with, with Golda and Rita and yeah Zed and Rita. So is there, and any, is there a voice clip of Rita dropping the F-bomb? Oh, no, God, yes. Yes, of <laughs> course. Oh, my God, that's but like here, nothing. And Scott, Scott <laughs> it was, all this whoa. stuff. Scott is the one who has all this he stuff. He has in, all in this stuff, so he took yeah, it with him. I swear to God, <laughs> some of this sh 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 Naughty, stuff. naughty. <laughs> <laughs> uh, make my monster I, I, grow? I, I, Just think about it. I would be concerned. <laughs> I mean, how many jokes we recorded? off of the line, make my Goldar grow? Come on. Me. Come on. Come on. Not today. Not today. No. no. That should be no. coming. And not for children. <laughs> yeah, well. Why does that mean, um, mommy? And I want to, uh, as, as, as wonderful as Scott was, and I and, and I don't want to get on a soapbox with then, but I, I, I'd be uh, remorse if I didn't uh, mention Bob Barron, who directed us oh. regularly in... Uh, Robotech uh, at Intersound and uh, Carl Masek, who Harmony those, Gold, who at Harmony Gold, he he was Robotech. He he made that show happen. Yes. And those two guys not only mentored me, 
Well, I mean, I, I, I never had a regular job after I got into Inner Sounds. Right, that was the right. end of waiting tables at 28 yeah. years old. All the classic anime. Yeah. So all the yeah. anime of the day when, you know, we, when it wasn't called anime. No, it wasn't called anime. Mm. We we shot a hundred shows in anime before that's anybody right. gave a damn yeah, about anime. That's right. We shot the original. Uh, What's Yamcha? The Yam Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball. Yeah, I was the boy. Nobody I, I was it. Goku. Nobody bought it. Nobody wanted it. I did five season, five episodes. <coughs> he was called Zero at the time. Oh. And Akira. Yeah. And well, there were, there were uh, Vampire Hunter D. Vampire Hunter D. I was Doris, the girl. <laughs> yeah. I mean, so many things that. I was Nancy. Cute. Man, be, I mean, that Vampire Hunter D was a badass show. Yeah, yeah and it it's was. still you've seen it. Hunter mm -hmm. D is my name. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> All right, Hunter D. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's actually politically incorrect now. If you yeah, watch, it's, it. it's vicious. It's not okay. Have you have you seen it? No. N not our hours. Oh, you see there's it. there's you even a one it. after hours, but. Yeah, I oh I, I don't well, know. I don't know. You think Goldar's bad? <laughs> <I'm just kidding>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'll try it. I'll yeah, try. no, it's it's wicked. So yeah, Carl Nasek <laughs> and Bob Barron. And there are, there are many others that were fun and made this job fun. Yeah. It's supposed yeah. to be fun, kind of fun, you know? And when it isn't, it can get pretty, it can get really opposite. It can really go upside down. For yeah. Oh. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was just, yes. Yeah, go for it. Well, I was just going to share. <laughs> many of you may, may already know this, but um, Paul Schreier, the gentleman who played Bulk. He was uh, a director for Sorry, something. I know. something. He directed our water park episode. Oh, oh yeah. 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 he's a good guy. No way. Yeah. yeah. Way. Yeah. And, and so it was really cool to interact with him oh, in that capacity as well. Yeah. Take direction from him. And he was just awesome and so positive and, uh, you know, encouraging and it wanted was to funny. have a lot of fun. Fun, yeah. 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 Funny. I'd like to go back and direct an yeah. episode. Yeah. Oh, I was going to say, um, gosh, this is such a long time ago, too. Um, the original Saban stunt team was, like, the best team. Like, not only did they really support us in martial arts, but they made sure to take care of us and made sure that we felt really good and really strong always. And always, we had such a good time. Yeah. I, yeah, I... I I have such a special place in my heart for the crew because as important as we are to be in front of the camera, the show literally will not go on yeah. without them. Yeah. Um, when I went over, it was during COVID, so we did a two-week government quarantine and the borders were closed. So we were there for nine months. Nobody could come in. Nobody could come out. I missed Thanksgiving. I missed Christmas. I missed New Year's. First time being away from my family. I actually was probably in like the lowest point of my life when I should have been at the highest and the crew very quite literally saved me. Um, I think if they weren't as wonderful as they were, I probably would have gone home in the middle of filming. And I don't even like to admit that because I, I think of myself as a very strong person, but I was not doing great. Um, and I just, yeah, I just, there's not one person that I had a problem with or that wasn't nice on set and it got to a point where I literally told Simon our EP that if I'm coming back the entire crew has to come back to either if they don't want to or if they're on another project is the only reason why they shouldn't come back or I'm not coming back like I everyone from camera department to wardrobe to the lighting crew was actually phenomenal like writers our stunt team Thankfully, we had a couple of the same between Dino and, and um, Cosmic, but we actually had a new-ish stunt team except for mine and Russell's um, double. And it was really cool because my double, it was her first time being on Rangers for Dino Fury. And so not only do I get to be like the female first, she gets to be the first female red stunt double. And so the fact that I like she was with me that entire time was also incredible. The crew, I... I could go on for literal weeks about my crew. I yeah, have nothing but yeah. raving reviews on them. I love that question. Thank you so much for that. It's a good question. Josh? Yeah. Yeah, in the book. Um, I'm just wondering, is so at the at the time over each cast, did you already have a feeling at that time that you 
knew you were coming into something that was or would be a big deal? No. Um, or at what yeah, probably not then. Finally, <laughs> what point did it finally hit? You? Hell no. No. This is a bigger deal than I realized <laughs> when I came into it. I feel like it's different. For like for me, well, I know going in how big Rangers is because it's 30th season. So I feel like it's different for you guys back then. It's My family now. in New York, uh, we saw the pilot together, and they looked at me like, <sighs> <laughs> "Well, Barbara, we're glad you got a day's work." <laughs> and uh, they thought it was weird. I mean, this you know, my parents are. Uh, look at me, you know, they're a little older than I was <laughs> at the time. And nobody thought, and I didn't think, I said, yeah, it's kind of weird, I know, it's an odd little, you know, show with monsters, and it wasn't usual. There was we, nothing like that in America. Yeah. We, like we, that. we knew, we knew we were on to something when we were doing a live show at Universal. Universal. Oh, yeah. uh, oh my uh, God. The freeway system was shut down. I couldn't get in through the front gate. I had to go in through the back, and I had to do the voice in the show because it was live. Yeah. I'm in the yeah. wings. And the guard said, you're not on the list. I said, my friend, this is starting in 22 minutes, and your job will be gone. Yes. <laughs> I did. And he got a little like, I said, I'd get on the phone right now because oh, yeah. i got to get oh, on the yeah. phone. Here's my name. <laughs> and, yeah, and he did get on the phone. And he was like, S -s 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 boom, go. No. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was. That's when we knew. We knew we, we were. Knew. We, we were and my old. son was five years old. And I was in uh, the preschool and, uh, or, I uh, know, preschool. And I got all the toys. I got a deal on the toys. And boy, was I popular with the oh parents. <laughs> Can you, oh, it's Christmas. Oh, bro, Barbara. You know, and, and also the auctions, you know, the silent auctions at school. Dude. Yeah. I got the Japanese guy at, uh, what's the? Bandai. Bandai. Mm -hmm. We became buddies, and, and, and I bought up, a, a, like, a, a bunch of Goldar figures. It cost, yeah. you know, I had to pay for them, but I knew they were going to run out of Goldars at the Toys R Us. I knew it mm -hmm. at Christmas, and I was the number wow. one one seller. I, I was, you were loved for a moment you know, there. I mean, <laughs> yeah, you can't find my toy anywhere. But there you go. So I knew we had stuff in common. <laughs> um, I went down to the Toys R Us, and I'm dead serious. I, I, it, not to make money, I didn't make money. I opened up my trunk. LOL. And they they came and, and I signed the things for free mm. and they were flabbergasted wow. that the voice yeah. of Goldar is out of here selling Goldars because there aren't no Goldars in there for Christmas. Before these things were things? Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah Dang. It was, it was amazing. That's we cool. had no clue. And, yeah, and, we had, and they, even when we were done, we had no clue that it would continue. Yeah. Right. Oh, no. We didn't know. Year after year. And, and, and conventions. We didn't go to the conventions in the beginning. We thought, well, you know, we're just the voices. We're not going to be important. So we tur I, I didn't go to them in the, when they started because I, just the voice of Rita, you know. I'm just, glad I chose, just the voice. Just, just the voice. Just, just her, you title, know. Title of the book, Just the Voice. Yeah. <laughs> so you were just the voice. Yeah. It would appear I'm like, her, okay. Like Jack in the Box, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so I think, I think uh, it hit for me when after we did our first two episodes mm -hmm. in season two, yeah. uh, they, they did the movie. And, and the movie was a mm -hmm. big yeah. hit, right? And then they were talking about possibly, they wrote into our contract when we came back the possibility of doing a movie with the Young Rangers. It didn't oh, end up too panning bad. Out, but that would have been a great one. It's an arm. Oh, contract. Yeah. But, mm -hmm. still? I think if they do that from now on, now it's like in there, it's so they can go mm -hmm. Maybe. So, that's when we knew it was a big deal. Yeah. one page. I did have a question for y'all. Oh, no, did y'all get to keep any props from your season? Look at, look at her face. Look at, look at her face. Uh, <laughs> yeah, go for it. Go for it. No, guys. Oh my god. I've kept this secret like my whole life, I'm and so now right. here we are. <laughs> After you hear it, you're not gonna clap. <laughs> um, no. Okay. So we had like finally wrapped, and I remember it was sixth grade, I was going into junior high school, and I thought I was like so excited walking in there, and I had 
um, we could bring things, show and tell, get yeah. um, to school. And so I had brought my communicator, and this kid was like, let me see it. <gasps> and he never gave it back. Oh, that's oh, true. No. Oh. Yeah. There's, Sue him. Call him. Yeah, right. my, she was like, do you know who it is? I was like, I do. You do? Oh, you do? Oh, I hit him up. Yeah. I'd be like, I I'd honestly do. would just be like, if you ha happen to have it, 30 years just later. because truly yeah. I just want it back. I just want it back. I'm in sixth yeah. grade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of all the things to oh steal, yeah, and never give it back. See, I'm so nasty. sorry. I yeah, know. I think about it. Oh, it just hurts yeah. my heart. Sorry, hold on. I want to get somebody out. What? Can you make your monsters grow? Oh. Huh? Oh, yeah, okay. <laughs> Must I hear this? Make my monster grow! <laughs> did you get to keep anything? So I did. I shared um, at the tribute last night. Um, I kept my own communicator, which I still have. Mm. Nice. And. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Hurts the soul a little bit. I <laughs> think <laughs> <laughs> I'll, get, I'll let you wear it so Thank you. <laughs> I won't give it to the boy from junior. <laughs> uh, uh, Jason David Frank gave me his on um, my my last day of filming. He wow. took it off and said, I want you to have this. And I, was like, I was like, wait a second, don't you have to go back and film me? I'll tell them I lost it. Aww. And that's they got more, yeah. When I looked at it closer, I could see the white paint, but under the white paint was green paint. So Aww. it was the original green communicator that they painted white when he became the white man. Mm. Cute. I stole a couple things from Seth. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's not leave. Yes, but long term bar. Not, not like, <laughs> but not like big things. Like we had a Halloween episode. I stole a little, um, like pumpkin prop. You didn't uh, your helmet? In Mascari Manor, um, no. In Mascari Manor, they had rubber duckies. I took a rubber ducky, stuff like that. But they let us keep our suits. <gasps> wow. <laughs> Dino, not cosmic. <laughs> Dino. But it's my it's my stunt doubles one piece. Uh, my main stunt double. I have um, actually. Do you guys know Kazu? He has been on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Kazu. Mm -hmm. Kazu's skirt. <laughs> because that was. I think that people didn't realize that they had skirts because all the men were all of the doubles, so the, they but had to wear skirts to be But sometimes the men popped in the, uh, yeah. the girls to be. So I have costume skirts. Did you have Masa? Yeah. Masa's Ours boots. Ours were only men. We only Masa's men boots. <laughs> wow. Just because they were still around for Dino Fury. Mm -hmm. And then like my own gloves and like gauntlets and stuff, but nothing so that my, my I had. It wasn't my suit. It was a bunch of pieces, but it fits. It all fits somehow. Nice. I can get in it. That's awesome. Not for a long time. <laughs> it's about time to wrap the panel up. Do y'all want to plug your socials or any projects you're working on right now? Cosmic oh, Fury! <laughs> what, were your, what was yours? Uh, uh, once and always. Oh, that, yeah. That movie. Special! Yay! <laughs> Yeah. I got nothing. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm working on next to it, but. I'm still teaching people how to cook. Yeah. Ah! Cooking. Okay, oh, yeah, her cooking. I'll be cooking. I'll oh. give it on that live stream later. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Cool. Oh, oh, Dragon Knights uh, Kung Fu Panda on TV. <gasps> Cute. Wait, I'm wait. the Queen of England. Really? Oh, oh my God. Yeah, you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a corgi. <laughs> a corgi? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you are. Yes. Just look me up. I don't know. My, uh, my <laughs> socials are Michael Argato and. Uh, next project is to hire a bunch of teachers for the yeah. next year. Yeah! <laughs> oh, Caneo! Yeah. Yeah. Nice. I'm not on social media. You're not on Cameo? You're going to see me is here. Oh, yeah, Cameo. And I'm not getting on social media. I have no platform. Thank you. Oh, yeah, yeah. Not Find me on Cameo. Hunter Dino. That's all it is. That's good. Can we uh, just take a group picture so everybody can yeah. get yeah. one real quick if they want? Yeah, yeah. 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 that's why I was like, yeah. it's, it's a nice box in here. Yeah. Oh, your face is freezing. Yeah. Oh, my phone, my phone. Oh, my water, my water. Oh, no. The lighting might um, be a little better. Right? Yeah. 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 Oh, my God.